So welcome to Finding Components Part B. This time we're using a slightly different example. If our vector now A is 8 meters south 40 degrees west, what are the x and y components of it? We're going to assume for this question that up is still plus y and to the right is still the positive x direction as it was in the last video. So clearly now we're in new territory. So we'll have to call this axis the negative x-axis and down we will call negative as well. It's the negative y. Other than that, it's basically exactly the same. As always, the x component and the y component have to add up to the entire vector. So we've got basically perfectly drawn here, a y plus a x. South 40 degrees west, that is this angle, is 40 degrees. The triangle that I've drawn is a right angle. And this is always going to be true when you're trying to find components. The original vector, in this case vector a, is the hypotenuse of the triangle, and the other two sides are in the two directions that we're interested in, in the two component directions. So same thing as before, now, y is on the adjacent side, so a y will be equal to 8 cos 40 degrees. 8 cos 40 degrees is 6.1 meters. The only thing you have to remember here that's different is that now it's down. So I've got to remember to put that negative in myself. It's in the negative y direction. The negative is instead of saying in square brackets a direction, we'll just put a negative in. AX equals 8 sine 40, which is 5.1. Again, it's negative. Still need units, though. So AX is minus 5.1 meters, and AY is negative 6.1 meters. To finish it off, we should just double check. We said that the original vector better be the sum of its two components. Does negative 5.1 plus negative 6.1 add up to 8? Hopefully it does. We have to, of course, use the Pythagorean theorem to check. AX is negative 5.1 squared. AY is negative 6.1 squared. And the magnitude of A will be the square root of all that stuff. When we do those square roots, we do indeed get 8 meters. So we know we've done everything properly.